Hey guys, welcome back to the video. Um, this is another one where I'm going to be packing my Bobby backpack full of stuff. This time it's going to be travel essentials. Uh, it's not going to be everything, but it's going to be well a lot that you would most likely bring on travel. So, oh, let's get started. <clears throat> so, this is the backpack. Uh, if you watched my other video, you probably know what it is. I have a review and a school edition of this, so watch those before you watch this or whatever you want. Okay, so let me just move these out of the way real quick. Uh, so I'm just going to leave it on the side. <clears throat> okay. So, the Bobby backpack. Big insides. A lot of... Uh, travel capabilities okay so first thing I accidentally missed this out on my school video um, <clears throat> well portable battery you can actually put this guy in here plug it up and do that if you want more detailed on any part of this uh, watch my review that's gonna have more detailed information about everything else. Okay, so for traveling, this is probably what you're gonna use. Um, okay, so this first piece is actually supposed to go here, but what I forgot was this. This guy is too big to fit. So I'm gonna use the one that didn't work, but just for demonstration purposes. just because it's smaller. Okay, so this guy plugs in right there. Cables go in. Yep. Okay, there you go. It didn't work because it was actually covering up the Velcro right here. So this guy couldn't stick. So if this guy goes right there on both sides like that. Creates sort of a, a center piece for organization, which is really nice. Um, and then there's two more pieces. The big one actually goes on the top, and then sticks to the center piece, while the smaller piece goes on the bottom, right in the middle. It's a little awkward right now, but uh, when I put stuff in, it should look better. So I'm going to start with the clothes. Um, I don't think I can fit everything in, but I can most likely fit a couple t-shirts here and like one or two pants here. These are all the shirts I brought with me for now. Let's just start with these three. Let's see if they... Okay, they don't fit in nicely. But they technically do fit. Uh, let's see what happens if you roll them up to save more space. Now you can fit one. Around two t-shirts, and then maybe one just flat, like that. <clears throat> okay, so yeah, uh, three t-shirts, and I'm, now that I look at this, I'm guessing one pants. Okay, so I have some pants. And you're obviously not going to carry everything you take on a trip with you in this one backpack. This is most likely for, let's say you're going to somewhere for a day, you don't want to bring that much stuff, this is perfect for that. So three shirts, one pants, one pants, or whatever. Uh, and now we have these two spaces left. And what I was thinking was putting in a camera, because this can actually support that. But I'm using it to film right now, so let me get something else. Okay, so I got a camera bag, which is 
what I used to put this camera in. Uh, but it's basically the same size, so I'm just going to use it to demonstrate. This can most likely fit perfectly snug right here. So now I have a camera, three t-shirts, a pants, and I still have a lot to get through. Um, I might actually be able to fit this large t-shirt in here, or a pair of shorts. So this guy fits in right here, actually fairly perfectly. And now it's pretty clean. Camera, three shirts, pants, uh, another shirt. And we're not gonna, like, if, if I were to actually go on a trip, I wouldn't wanna um, access this right away. It, especially when I'm on like a plane or something. So that's where this sleeve comes in. This guy can actually zip up and hide everything inside. So that's, well it's not clean, it's pretty wrinkled, but uh, now it's hidden. So it, wouldn't, it shouldn't be falling around or moving while um, you're traveling. Okay, so now, actually this might be able to fit in. It was the rain jacket from earlier. There was space down here. Pop that in, and you're good. It was actually working better than I thought. Okay. <clears throat> Sorry about the air conditioner noise, by the way. It got really hot in here. You might be able to see my other videos. Anyways, I have a Nintendo Switch. This one I want to access pretty frequently. Let's say if I'm on a plane or train ride, I'm not going to put it in any of these large compartments. So I'm going to disassemble this guy and put it, let's say, in one of these mesh pockets. So I have a game cartridge holder. So that guy can go in first. And then my controllers can go in like that. And if you see my Switch video, you know that they come with these little um, straps. These guys can actually just slide in to the side right there, right here. And then I guess just put in the cables. Um, I'll get to the Switch itself later, but. Oh wait, actually. Oh yeah, that's perfect. Never mind. Uh, it's not as big as a tablet, so it doesn't really have to go in the back tablet slot. If you watched my other video, uh, but this is actually a pretty good location for it. Uh, other things are, say, I have some things I want to carry on. I have a mouse and my computer charger. This guy can go right here fits perfectly and then I have the wall adapter just do that it should actually fit in the back right here and then the mouse can join one of these actually just put it back here That works. Okay, um, what else? I have a deck of cards. I have some sun or glasses or glasses case. This one might be the tricky one. Um, I have a tablet and the laptop. Okay, so let me just uh, get these two strapped in so that it's easier to put stuff in vertically. The button locks together and then you use the Velcro to stick and it's connected. Same on the other side, right here.
connected. And then you can just zip up a little bit so it's easier when you're putting everything in later on both sides. Okay, and then on this side, if you open it, uh, now it only hangs out around 45 degrees. Okay, so I want to put in my tablet first. So I want to undo this little latch right here. Put in my tablet. Slides in. Okay, next thing I want to do, put in my laptop. This guy should fit in. It's struggling a little bit. Probably because of how tight it is right now. Um, and then you can redo this Velcro. Stick it on. And you should be able to zip it all up. Okay, now I forgot to take this out in my previous video. I have a, another tablet in here. Uh, well, I guess you can use that for traveling too. Let's put that guy in. Um, and I also carry around my phone. And my wallet. And another card. So, this pocket here can fit any transit card or credit, debit, anything that size and it'll stay hidden away there. Passports can go down in the bottom pocket or if you want to hide away your phone for a second like that. Wallet should fit fairly easily. Closes up. Okay, on the right side, there's another pocket. This is a key holder, but there's just enough space in there for some cards. So let's stick that in there. And finally, the glasses case. So this is supposed to be a water bottle strap, but let's say you only need your glasses when you really need them. This is obviously not what it's made for, but if you do this, you could strap it right there. This actually works better than I thought. And it's like a fidget toy too. Anyways, uh, yeah, uh, let me bring back my scale to see how much this guy weighs compared to my other one. This one feels a fair bit lighter. Okay. And then let's put this guy on. Uh, 6.3, that's not bad. The last one was around 7 point something. That was with a bunch of school materials and papers heavy. Um, so just like the other one, I'm gonna take out everything, or let me wear it first, and then I'll take out everything, see how it goes. Okay, so uh, 
Okay, get down lower. Um, I'm gonna try wearing the backpack again and see how it looks. Okay, both sides go on pretty nicely. Glasses are still here. Okay, um, let me zoom out a bit. Okay, so what the backpack looks like with all the travel materials on, it actually feels pretty light. Uh, it's not that bad. Okay, um, glasses, easily accessible. Pull it up or undo the strap. Blah, blah, blah. Another thing I figured out was I have a, a fan. Let me bring it. There's a pink fan. So if you actually strap it on, or after you turn it on, get it on like this, you can actually, or yeah, stick it, and it's, you don't have to hold it, and it's like blowing air into your face. Uh, this is, I guess it's good for traveling in the sun or something, but I mean, I thought it was pretty cool. You can use this water bottle strap for almost anything. Well, now let me unpack everything I put into the backpack, uh, and that should be the end of the video. Let's get right to it. Okay, well, let's quickly get started. I'm running out of battery on my camera. Okay. So what we put in the back was my tablet. In here was my phone, if I can get it out. My wallet. In here was a card. In the side pocket, deck of cards. Okay, so that was it for this section. Now if we open it. Right now it opened 90 degrees. If you want all 180, undo this strap. That side gets loose, same with this side. And it's all open. Okay, so got a charger, mouse, the other charger, two switch Joy Cons, the straps, games. Switch itself. Now you can play it. Uh, what else? I had this tablet in here. And my laptop. That was it for this side. On this side, I zipped it all up. If I do that, should be able to undo it. Pretty easily. Whoa. Okay. Let me fix my camera here. I have a really sketchy setup. Anyways, this side unzips, unzips. I'll leave that here for now. I had camera, or not really a camera, but I'm using it right now. Um, rain jacket for the bag. A long sleeve t-shirt, three short sleeve t-shirts, one pair of pants, and then these guys came out. And then now you have the whole bag. 
with the portable battery. Anyways, thank you guys so much for watching this video. If you liked it, uh, please leave a thumbs up. This took a really long time to make. Um, yeah, I'd say this backpack is good for traveling and school. Uh, if you want to watch my other videos, they'll be linked in the description. They are um, my travel, this one, travel essentials. Uh, my school supplies and the review itself. Uh, I'll have another video in around a month or so about my experience with it because I just got this backpack and this just to like show you guys what it can do. But anyways, thank you guys so much for watching. If you want to see more videos like this, please press like and if you really liked it, subscribe. Bye.